the octonauts and the marine iguanas. Do you know, this red seaweed will be a yummy treat at the seaweed feast this year. Let's go check in with the captain. Chairs, check. Napkins, check. Now, what about the menu? It's all organised, sir. We have red seaweed soup, followed by red seaweed stew, red seaweed sausages, and your favourite, red seaweed on a stick. Super, super! Sounds like a lot of lovely seaweed, Shellington. Good job. Thank you, sir. Vegemals, off to the kitchen to get everything ready for tomorrow. <laughs> Peso, you're in charge of entertainment. All taken care of, Captain. Xylophone music. I've been practising. Oh, bravo, Peso. That just leaves the question of where to have the feast. Since we're stationed near the Galapagos Islands, how about having it on the nearest island? Good idea, Dashi. But I want to make sure we don't disturb any of the animals there. Oh, no worries, sir. There's just a bunch of rocks and these iguanas. I think we can stay out of their way. Ted! Yeah. Sneezy! Hey. Iggy! Iggy! Oh, right, that's me. <clears throat> OK, boys, now remember, we're marine iguanas. And what's the one thing we do better than any other iguana in the world? Ooh, 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 uh, walk on tippy toes. No! We're the only iguanas who dive in the ocean for food. And what do we love to eat more than anything? Seaweed! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes, we eat seaweed. And today, I found a giant clump of fat, juicy, red seaweed. Just waiting to be eaten. Cool, you did. Right down there. It's growing in some kind of big orange thingy, but I guess that's just how it grows. So, how about it, boys? Let's do lunch. Yes! Yeah. OK, prepare to die. Ready? Get set. <laughs> Seaweed. This way, boys. Captain, somebody's broken into the octopod. And they're heading to the garden. Dashy, sound the octo alert. Octonauts, to the garden pod. <gasps> Our seaweed, it's gone. Who could have taken it? Hmm. Whoever it was must have left some clues. <gasps> yes, some strange claw prints. And over here, it looks like slimy salt. Yuck! And long, wet tail tracks. They seem to lead to this vent. It looks like they came in from there, took the seaweed and left. What about the seaweed feast tomorrow? We still have some seaweed left in the kitchen. We should be fine for the feast. Phew! Phew. That's great news, but just to make sure nothing happens to it... Oh, guard it, Captain. Those scurvy seaweed snatchers won't get past me. Mmm, boy, that was some good eating. Yes, it certainly was. I don't know about you fellas, but I'm getting hungry again just thinking about it. <sighs> Who's up for a snack? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Aha! 
Now that's a clue! Open the Octa Hatch. Octonauts, let's follow them. Follow who, Captain? We don't even know what these seaweed snatchers look like. All we saw was a tail. Hmm. Let's just think this through. What do we know about them? Well, there must have been a few of them, because we saw a lot of footprints. Aye, right. and don't forget all that slimy salt on the floor. Hmm. And the long, scaly tail. Just like the iguanas in Dash's pictures. Well, but they can't be iguanas. Iguanas don't swim in the ocean, do they? Wait a minute! Iguanas? Galapagos Islands? Missing seaweed? Of course! Marine iguanas! Marine iguanas? Yes. Marine iguanas are a special kind of iguana who only live in the Galapagos Islands. They're also the only kind of iguanas who can swim and their favourite food is seaweed. But what about the salt? The seaweed they eat is very salty, so they sneeze out the extra salt. <laughs> Good job, Shellington. At least now we know who we're after. And there they be. Let's get those marine iguanas and find out what they've done with our seaweed. Octonauts, hold on. Yikes! Some blue thingy came out of the big orange thingy, and now it's coming after us. we got to get out of here fast! Yeah. <laughs> it's getting close up. <laughs> They're trying to lose us in the seaweed. Hang on, we're going in. This way, the seaweed's thicker over here. They'll never make it through. Turn off the propeller, Quasi. We don't want to get stuck. Hold on, we're going down. Ah. It's no good. We're stuck. We can't get out. See? Nobody gets through seaweed like an iguana. Didn't you hear them, guys? I think we should help. Yeah, the hatch is stuck. We're trapped. Hmm. <laughs> the marine iguanas aren't swimming away, and they do like seaweed. I have an idea. Um, excuse me, marine iguanas, are you still hungry? Huh? <laughs> How would you like a nice big juicy seaweed snack? Wow, look at them eat. You've been a great help. Yeah, thanks. But what'd you do with our red seaweed? Uh, sorry, we ate it. That's what I was afraid of. We didn't know it was yours, honest. We thought it just grew in that big orange thingy. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Then that's it. If the red seaweed's gone, then we can have no seaweed feast. Oh, listen. There's a lot of seaweed that grows right around the island. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, we've got brown seaweed, green seaweed. Maybe not as good as the red seaweed, but still pretty good. Come on. We'll show you where the good stuff is. Yeah, yeah. Good stuff, good stuff, yeah. <laughs> Octonauts, the seaweed feast is back on. And this year, we'll have some very special guests. Ah, this seaweed needs a little salt. Oh, oh, oh let me help. Yes, I, I, I feel a sneeze coming on. <laughs> That's okay, matey. I'll just use the salt shaker. <laughs> Thanks very much. 